In the Holy Quran, Allah says that uh, um, if all the oceans were ink and they were replenished after thereafter, after their use, to write down Allah's words, then they would be would run out. They would run out, and Allah's words would, would still be there to be written. Um, now, what, since we know that the Holy Quran uh, addresses all the needs of mankind and very little ink is used to write it. What are all these other words of Allah? Are they also addressed to man or are they other kinds of words which cannot be written by all this ink? You see, if you wander over the intricacies of nature, each leaf of grass or, or tree or, fruit or, or flower tells a story of Allah's grandeur and how it works. According to Muslim, not even a leaf falls without uh, revealing the grandeur, grandeur of Allah's great design. So if you keep pondering over these things, you will find so many signs of Allah in this universe that each animal, each tree, each plant, each flower, each fruit tells a tale of Allah's glory. And then look at, convert your gaze on, 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 I mean, divert your gaze to animals, insects, etc., and the birds who fly, and the camels, and the goats, and the cattle which give milk for you. Why was milk created and how? So you think and think and think and you continue to think all your life and still you cannot count everything. But there are so many things hidden from our view. Whatever is happening in the sea and the oceans, how many life forms there are, and how they survive and how they are catered for by Allah. So it's an amazing story and there is no shadow of doubt left that if you think only of the of one sort of life spread over the globe, still you will not be able to count the wonders this life contains. Right? Who is this lady? Yes, this lady is Mrs. Hafida Bagelu from Mauritius. She's currently living in, in England and she has a very short nazam she'd like to read. If Since for how long? Uh, the pilo, uh, the pika. Pardon? Oh, about 20 years. 20 years ago. A lot of time I met you was uh, forgotten. Mm. So we have time either for nazam or for question. Okay. It's mm. her choice. Si vous voulez qu'on pose nazam ou bien question? No, nazam. nazam. Okay, nazam. nazam. تعریف کی قابل ہے یا رب تیرے دیوانے آباد ہوئے جن سے دنیا کے حویرانے تعریف کے قابل ہے یا رب تیرے دیوانے کب پیٹ کے دھندوں سے مسلم کو بھلا فرصت کب پیٹ کے دھندوں سے مسلم کو بھلا فرصت ہے دین کی کیا حالت یہ اس کی بھلا جانے تعریف کے قابل ہیں یا رب تیرے دیوانے یا رب تیرے دیوانے جو جاننے کی باتیں تھی ان کو بھلایا ہے جو جاننے کی باتیں تھیں ان 
को भुलाया है जब पूछे सबब क्या है कहते हैं खुदा जाने तारीफ के काबिल हैं यारब तेरे दीवाने यारब तेरे दीवाने सर मस्ती से खाली है दिलीश से आ रही है सर मस्ती से खाली है दिल इश्क से आ रही है बेकार गए उनके सब सागर पैमानी तारीफ के काबिल हैं यारब तेरे दीवाने यारब तेरे दीवाने खामोशी सितारी है मजलिस की फिजाओं पर खामोशी सितारी है मजलिस की फिजाओं पर फानूस ही अंधा है या अंधे हैं परवाने तारीफ के काबिल हैं या रब तेरे दीवाने या रब तेरे दीवाने फरजानों ने दुनिया के शहरों को उजारा है फरजानों ने दुनिया के शहरों को उजारा है आबाद करेंगे अब दीवान ये वीराने तारीफ के काबिल हैं यारब तेरे दीवाने यारब तेरे दीवाने होती न अगर रोशन वो शम में रुखे अनवर होती न अगर रोशन वो शम में रुखे अनवर क्यों जमा यहाँ होते सब दुनिया के परवाने तारीफ के काबिल हैं यारब तेरे दीवाने यारब तेरे दीवाने है साथ सादाई इस्लाम की जंगों की है साथ सादाई इस्लाम की जंगों की आगाज तो मैं कर दू अंजाम खुदा जाने तारीफ के काबिल हैं यारब तेरे दीवाने यारब तेरे दीवाने Next time we'll begin for you, right? Right?